Here's what I've been looking for. I've been wanting that. <laughs> and I found a bolt and a nut. Wow, that was his favorite find of the day, y'all. Let's go repair <laughs> my lawnmower. <laughs> She calls me day and night I'm sorry girl, you just don't make me feel right I never meant to make you cry, you were right Just leave me be, I'm not gonna put up a fight And every time you wake up feeling worse And then you check the time never... Smile Hey y'all Hey y'all Tammy here with Davis. Whoop, whoop. Welcome to Vintage Uprising Texas. And look who's joining us. It's Jack Jack. Give him a kissy. <laughs> Better him kissing you than me like that. Hey, we spent, took three days in Round Top. We, uh, I don't know what days they were, but we went three different days and I'm gonna show you everything right now because I'm behind of our Round Top haul. You already saw the shop alongs, and now here's the the haul. And it's gonna be a lot, so we're gonna try to go through this quick. This is gonna be a little bit longer than our 20 minute video. He's biting me. Okay, so we're gonna get started. But first, a word this. from our sponsor. <laughs> if you are new here, please consider subscribing to us. Give us a thumbs up. And leave a comment below. I'm telling you now, leave a comment below of your favorite thing. So keep that in mind, what you see, and leave a comment about whatever you want. Because, you know, that helps our algorithm and everything. Is he hacking? Are you, no. are you barking? Are you? Anyways. Why don't you make him mad? <laughs> um, so, let's get started. The first thing I got, y'all all know that I collect these. I have a whole little shelf over there of um, these paper mache piggy banks. And I don't have an apple with a worm in it. Now he is messed up. He's got a bobo right there and he's got a slight crack right there. But I love them, so I still get them. <laughs> Although I'm running out of root. Anyways, that's beside the point. Next. I don't even know where I'm gonna be putting stuff. I can't put them behind me because Jack say, Jack is gonna to try to bite things. So I'm gonna You should have got an empty box. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> this is gonna be through the whole show. Anyways, what you got? We have some ephemera. Ugh. Weird food. <laughs> okay, so I picked up um, this. It's in one of those little uh, folders. It was some eight by 10 pictures. Now I like getting these because I craft with them, but if you're interested in them first, you better claim them because otherwise I'm going to um, make them Repurpose witches them. In, and warlocks or something. But so I got that. We also got this sweet advertisement with the calendar. What does that say? How do you say that? H. I la bonne H croque H croque. It's in French. I was gonna say I don't think this is English because <laughs> I can't pronounce any of it or on here. I thought it was a calendar at first, but it was a uh, it was cute. And there's a little memo pad right here. Is that a memo pad or a calendar? It's a calendar, isn't it? It might be a calendar. If, yeah, it is a calendar. I don't got my glasses on. I can barely read it. But So the little mini calendar there, and I guess you would put your mail in here. So we have that. Then I did get this little rude food, and I'm not going to really show this on here, but, you know, you get a little glimpse idea. You got your imagination is, is rude food. But it's, it's not necessarily a recipe. Yeah, it's not necessarily recipes. So, anyways, it was it was just a little fun thing that I thought could do be on um, Margarita Night. 
whenever we do that. Okay, what do you have? What's photos? I have photos from, they're called Bye -bye Bird? Screen Gems. Oh. Screen Gems, and these are from Bye Bye Birdie. Black and whites. I'm going to show these real quick because we have a few of those. And these are all Bye Bye Birdies? These are the ones you're showing, yeah, Bye Bye Birdie. Oh, okay. There's a glare. There's some dancing. You've seen that meme lately. Oh. <laughs> really? Mm -hmm. That's where that comes from. That's from Bye Bye Birdie, yeah. Then there's some from Peyton Place. Then from Prisoner in the Middle. Great Jack Jack running around. And I'm not sure where this is from. It's like it was just at a party, but it's a Omar Sharif. Oh, the burglars. Diane Cannon and Omar Sharif. Look at young Diane Cannon. Diane Cannon. Mm. And then this one from the Poseidon Adventure. What have we gotten ourselves into? So those are fun. Are these something too? From there? You can show me up. I don't know what they are, but you go. They're like hot pads. Oh, hot pads. This is the Battleship Texas. They don't know what they're They just refurbished it. Just got out of dry dock. I don't know what they're going to do with it. But is it's it finished, back here? But it's refurbished. Is it back? They're not taking it back there. They're trying to oh. figure out where to take it. Oh. There's the Alamo. Remember that? Remember the Alamo? <laughs> and the same center monument, which is going to be all by itself because they're not going to take the ship the back. Ship that's back that's just it. not right. Yeah, it's silly. So those are like a thick cardboard, um, I guess hot plates or pitchers or something like that. So here we have some, this is a Hershey's, Chris, what is it called? Crystalite? It holds a uh, high, high C. Oh, I said Hershey's, didn't I? High C. It holds three candlesticks. It's a uh, triple light. Triple light. So I just want to say we were doing a personal shopping for um, for some one of our customers, and we did pick up a lot of uh, clear glass uh, candlestick lights. So I am going to offer these to her first because I was personally shopping for her, but what she doesn't buy will be coming to a sale soon. Yeah, let us know which one's your favorite. Yes, these let's are do pretty. that. So we have the Hershey's. Okay, this pair. Hershey's. What'd you say? High C. High C. I keep saying uh -huh. High C. I mean Hershey's. And this one is um, a two, two candlestick holder. And it's, um, what is it called? Perdon um, City Glass? Payton City. Payton City? Mm -hmm. And it's frosted. Yeah, frost. Oh, it's frost. It's a frost pattern. See, so these are double lights. He knows lights. more about this than I do. Payton City double lights frost pattern. Got a pair of those. I guess we can leave them back there or just put them on. You can put, start putting those over there. And then we have here a Tiffin. Flanders. You go ahead and say this one. Tiffin Flanders double white. I think I only bought a single of these. This one was a single. It has this pretty um, etched flowers Gorgeous on the base. Etching. And then this one is. Indiana glass too light. Is that, oh, I thought that was a bird right there. But it little swoop up. But this was a single one too. We only found one of those, and it also has a little bit of etching on the base. Oh, this is all round top. Yeah, okay. that's why I'm like, where's the other ones? Yeah, we do have more like, that, that came from that? another place, so that will be in another haul. So here, I 
found some Kokeshi's, Grandma and Grandpa. These are different, very cute. I do not have these, so I may keep these for my collection. But I, my shelf is too full, so I might be switching some out, you know, to make room. I'm not gonna make another shelf of these. <laughs> and then this one, I have another one somewhere. It'll be coming along somewhere. It's, it's in the pile of this mess somewhere. <laughs> so yeah, I picked these up, little fun pieces. And then we have a little card holder. Do you, what do you think? This is just plastic or what? Um, yeah, it's plastic. It looks like to it's me- It's very ornate. Like a, um, like a dome, like some kind of um, a dome that I've seen in pictures with the little pocket doors or something. <laughs> I don't know, but it, it has this uh, basket weave finish. It did come with cards. I have not checked them yet. They're the windmill. Got windmills on them. So. And here's the Joker. I know a lot of people like to see the Joker or an extra card, it says. Hmm. That's interesting. So we have this card set. Little card holder. Did you find anything? Yeah, there's a... It's a little the, design under the lid, but I'm trying to figure out who, who made it, and I think, oh, I can't tell. There is a manufacturer of this. Now, I went to a place um, that we got some linens from, and I had picked up a bunch of these little uh, crocheted rose, rose flowers or whatever. So, I, I told y'all I've been doing flannels, you know, working on flannels. Um, and I'm going to use these for that, but I'm showing y'all little fun pieces that I picked up. What is this made out of? I don't know. Yeah. You think I know? Or? I'm sorry, but I buy what I like and I like what I buy. I don't know makes and models or material necessarily, <laughs> but it's a little hand mirror, a peach little hand mirror. And I just, I, I do love that little hand mirror. So the mirror is in good c condition so it's veneer it's i don't know i don't know it's why are you putting me on the spot i don't know plastic. yeah but let me just tell you it does have a little wave in it in the back From the so, heat dryer. yeah but i've seen these uh designs on the wall where they collect mirrors and it just it looks so pretty Jack Jack's gonna be in this video <laughs> all over this video and here we got some, these are pretty cool. These are teeth cleaners, right, David? Open your mouth. I don't know. Teeth, it, it scrapes the uh, um, plaque? plaque off your teeth. Okay. Open. Is that what that is? Because <laughs> it's dirty, you're not putting it on. <laughs> this is a, <laughs> a button lace shoe thing. You know, it, uh, those vintage shoes, it helps, you know, get the button through the hoe. Yeah, that's what these are. This is a tall one. It's, can't see in the, with all that busy background. And then I found a shorter one, a little cute short one here. Just for crocheting, that. right? No, I just said it was for the buttons on your boots to, to hook your buttons through the loop hose. Okay. You know, that vintage boots that they had back then? Okay. I'm sure there's a the more formal name. That's what they told you? Yeah. This is where you got your uh, your pretty little linen. That. So, pick those up. They're just fun. They're cute. I mean, nobody uses them anymore, I don't think. Unless you do use them to clean your teeth. I don't know. You let me know. What you got? Pretty little linen, what you said? Yeah. This is That came from the same place. And if you watched my video, you would have seen that in there. A little so doily. A doily from Germany. Very pretty. I think the, I don't know if the lady was shocked I was buying. It was this here? Well? No, no. Nah. What is that? Just. Carpet bag? A carpet bag. No, this isn't carpet, but it's got these little plastic beads on it. It's a, 
probably like a fake leather. I only got one of those from her? Fake leather purse. Yes, you did. Only one. Wow. Because they were pretty pricey. And if y'all watched my video, y'all would have saw. I zoomed in some of the price. One of them was $125. But anyways, we got this little crochet-like purse. I thought it was very boho-like. Very cute. Tammy got it. this cigarette tin. Show us more cigarettes. Tin class of cigarettes. Mm -hmm. Did I buy this? It was this was from um, what was his name? Old Man Joe. Oh yeah, it was all bundled together. Yeah, so it was a this bundle little set. ephemera, little uh, notebook. Take notes in. There's a couple of those. <laughs> this is your hip nip handy flask. We didn't have the flask, but we love the logo. Yes, I love the box. And it's so cute. I would put that on the back my back bar if I have to. Yeah. Have but it did have some little knickknacks in there. Just some little toys, little plastic toys and knickknacks. Maybe there'll be a giveaway. I don't know. Well though don't be surprised if they end up in your box. <laughs> then Tim Tim got um, needles? Yeah. Pins. He just had these there, the, a bunch of little straight pins. And the, you know, you sewers know. You know what this is. The, the movie trivia game, pocket trivia. Then Tam Tam got a camera that she doesn't have. No, I have that one. So oh. I'll probably offer that one up. It must have been a great price if she already had it. What are you doing? Stop biting me. I was going to say, we have Blinko, but that's ours. Tammy bought cigars. <laughs> and, and, not only that. <laughs> cigarettes. Slims. Slims. See, you at the cancer okay. center, Tammy. Tam. So, I got those so I could use them in my displays. Because we're always picking up stuff that has to do with cigarettes. Because in the 60s, 70s. You know, that was a big thing. 50s, 60s, 70s, whatever. Ooh, I'm going to handle this because this is old, old milk glass. I think this would be antiques, definitely. These are antiques. Old milk glass. This was long and oval-like. Well, that one's kind of oval-shaped, too. They're slightly That's different. have a mark of 13 on the back. Like pressed. This one looks like it may be missing more so of the paint than that other one. But But it's almost like a goofus paint? Yeah, yeah. Very similar. But very pretty. I like those. Then I found this nice silver serving tray. That's good. Silver serving tray, which folds nicely away. Would a dish fit in that? Or no? You could, yeah. Or a paper plate. Here's what I've been looking for. I've been wanting that. <laughs> and I found a bolt and a nut. Wow. That was his favorite find of the day, y'all. Let's go repair my lawnmower. <laughs> that face. I got this brooch. Isn't this pretty? There we go. I think this is a frog tin tin. Yes, ribbit. But it is so ribbit. cute. Look oh, at the what is this? flowers. Yes, what is this? I just sewed some rock glasses that in this design. I love that. Is it anchor hawking? I think I've never seen this though. I've never seen it in a frog. I've seen that. I think it's anchor hawking. Maybe. I could be wrong, y'all. I'm going. I'm flying off the seat of my pants. But um, they have that in green and amber. But that's the first time I've seen that bow with a frog on it, or much less even the bow. Here's another doily. They hid the flaw with their sticker. Buyer beware. But you could that flaw's gonna be hidden with something else. So David's like gonna end up keeping a little that because I'm sure none of y'all would want that because there's a hole in the center, dear Liza, dear Liza. Another pretty high C candy bowl. Is that high C? I didn't know that. If not, it's old pressed because it is nice. 
maybe it doesn't have the fire color. I don't know. It's got very good clarity, so it could be high seat. But th this, this, you know, once this was designed, this they had a lot of copycats. And if it's not high seat, let me know. <laughs> Let's show some mugs. Well, la, la. Let me get this out of the way. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. No tay for you, boy. We have this, uh, of course, this is the, I don't know what pattern this is, but optic. it's a green. Block optic. Black optic. Okay. But it's Blocked a, optic. Black optic. Blocked optic. That's a tongue twister. So, and it does glow, don't it? Doesn't it? I believe so. Yeah. I think so. <laughs> now I don't remember. But yeah, I don't know if we even tested it, but I do believe this one does. We have that one. Here's a shower and not a glower, and it's Pyrex. That's going into my little coffee collection. And these are dirty. We haven't washed this yet, you know, because then I might even take longer to get it to the hall. What is this? Is this, what color is this? Is this peachy or amber? It's like that peachy amber. Look at that. That rose, rose amber. Oh. So what brand is this? Do you know? Because I don't. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Tell us this. Y'all can help us. Tell what? us this in the comments below. I'm not sure. It has a triangle on the bottom. What else, Tim? Okay. I picked this up because I do collect cameras, as you can see. Oh, maybe you can't see, really. The cameras are on the other side of this shelf. Um, I do not her, have this color. She'll leave her camera video below. No, I gotta read. I gotta post it. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyways, I got this one because I don't have this color. I have the turquoise one, but my there's a, a series. These are the ones I want to collect. The colored ones um, to finish off my collection because I got enough cameras. I got a lot of cameras, so we'll leave that at that. That one will be mine. And then I got this cute little purse. It's a, a velour purse with pearls on it. It is older. It is missing maybe one, maybe just one. I was going to say one or two pearls, but it looks like it's just missing one there. It's a drawstring little uh, purse, but, but that's not all. Look, there's a hat with it. And we'll let Jack demonstrate that. Hi, Jack. Say, isn't it pretty? Hi, what do you think, Jack? Jack, what do you think? He's so cute. I hope he bites you. <laughs> He's always biting me. Like, that would be news. <laughs> you can't he looks like it. the weasel from the River Bottle Nightmare Man. River Bottle Nightmare Man. <laughs> 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 but it is a, it has this elastic um, band in it. This one is missing a few pearls on the edges. But it's super cute. It's a little matching set to put on your doll or something. If you have dolls or your grandkids or do a photo shoot with a new baby coming. And a nice swivel frame. Nice swivel frame. With a photo and, of and her name Esther, name. Esther Otts. From 19? Is that 19? 30? Esther Otts graduation picture. Mm. 1932. Oh, and then we have this cute little a blue bird. It's plastic. A little blue bird pin. Isn't that cute? It's so sweet. Uh, let get it focus a little bit. Really cute. And here we have these are those old little um, vintage clips. We have two wiener dogs white plastic with the little clips and then a what is um Schnau. schnauzer blue little schnauzer the little plastic clips aren't those cute i love the i love little brits and here's a nice metal too slow to be a paperweight but it's an elephant nice little probably a memento 
I don't think it's bronze. It's not patina like bronze, so it's a, another metal, heavy metal. And here I have a little necklace fan. That's a little tarnished, so I'm gonna try to clean that up. But it's not just a necklace of a fan, it is a clock, a watch, a clock. Cool, huh? I thought that was pretty. I haven't checked to see if it works yet. Don't know nothing about it, but I just liked it. I thought it was really pretty. What's this in here? Isn't that cute? What is it? Isn't it fabulous? All those colors. It, it is. Pull it. It is a like a dually. Let's go back a little bit. It's a little dually. It was in um, pieces. It's a little odd shape because of the ending there. Um, I think it had one extra, and the lady told me her mother sewed it, you know, what was left of it together. But they're so cute. There's a little crochet, brown, orange, and tan flowers. This would look good on the back of the couch or the back of a chair or on your coffee table, you know. Also very boho, isn't it? But I just loved it. I thought it was fun. A little fun piece. Good gravy. Good gravy. What? Good gravy. Hmm. It was a thing to say. <laughs> so this piece behind you. Ooh. Deco, deco. Nice little serving tray. Put your, um, what's the sandwiches you cut the crust off? Is it chicken salad sandwich? Yeah. I don't know. You can cut the crust off of anything. Chicken salad, we'll do that. I'll definitely serve me some PB and J on that. Beautiful chrome, nice little bake light ball, bake light handle. I like that one. And oh, you want to show the? Did you no, show these? No, those are later. Okay. Those are the stars of the show. Here we got a apron, an apron, a apron, an apron. Where's the? Is this the front? Yeah, this is our front. It has little pockets on it, a pocket on it. It's that um, velour, um, see-through uh, sheer apron with this lovely orange flower pattern. I thought that was really pretty. I can't put that behind me. The dog's gonna go start after it. And then I got a bunch of little linens. I picked up this little hanky. This is, I'm gonna have to do this fast because there's quite a bit here. Some yeah, little all that fabric for you. dually hankies. Now, actually, um, these little ones I'm doing a project with. A friend of mine, we're planning a project, so I will be keeping those like this for that. The, definitely the smaller ones. And then I got this piece of fabric. Look at this. Isn't this so Art Deco, right? Is that what you say, Deco? No, mid-century. Mid-century? Hmm. Okay, somewhere in Deco. there. Somewhere in there. I love that. That's fabric. That's just fabric. Oh, we got this crochet little uh, purse. It's got a drawstring on it. Look at that. And you drawstring it. And I don't know. How do you carry it? Like this? Works for me. <laughs> I know. But it's a cute little um, little purse. Or I don't know what it, what it fully it might be. Then I got a... Goofus glass platter or plate. So we know that's very old glass. Some of the, well, a lot of the paint is off, but pretty nonetheless. Always happy to find a piece of that because you know you're getting something old. Got some red or pink. I think it's red. Is this pink or red? It's a rose. A rose color um, velvet fabric. I picked this one up for somebody. This is um, green uh, felt fabric. So I picked this up for someone, this bundle. Um, little, this is a child's pillowcase. pillowcase. Yeah, there you go. With some embroidery. Got another, this won't be a part of the project, so this will probably be available. Big round white dually. We got David picked up a bunch of little linens. 
So pinkies, uh, some. I think I'm gonna laundry napkins. these so I can iron them because they're all wrinkled. Yeah, they were all in like a one Did of those pretty little doilies. chest cases. So some square ones. Some ornate hankies or doilies. Just some. Oh, this one has chickens on it. If you can see that. And this was a. Oh, this is two. There's two here. I don't know how many of whatever is here is of. Then some more of the little white dually hanky. I mean, not hanky, so I don't know why I keep saying that. Okay, put that aside. And we have this. This is cool. Uh, game table cover. A game table cover? Or did you say game? Game. <laughs> What you said? What? I thought you said gain. <laughs> game table Because there's a gun on it. I thought that's why you said that. No. But look, there's guns in the corner and um, cards, poker chips. So it's probably uh, Texas Hold'em. Yeah, it's, it's a fun little piece. It's a little square and it has some um, strings on the corners to tie it down, I guess, around the legs. But it was just a little fun piece. I like that one. Never seen that before. Then I picked up some butterfly fabric. Of course, that's probably going to go on my um, flannel shirts I was thinking about using. And Ooh, then I got this. Or on shelf where all her other material is. <laughs> Don't tell on me. And then they we have it. this cute they little uh, pink fabric, kind of like lace. You see there? And then, of course, you know, as much as I try not to, I try not to collect any Raggedy Ann and Andy anymore. But I came across this and I couldn't help myself. This is a plastic uh, tablecloth. Yeah, it's a plastic, white on the back, just plain plastic. I thought it might have some of that felt on the back. But it's a tablecloth. My kids might need that on their dinner table. I say my kids, my grandkids, and my kids. Anyways, and I got some, this fabulous piece of fabric, uh, Swiss dot, yellow, flowery, so pretty, so, so pretty. And then we got this piece. They love fabric, Dave. They love fabric. Y'all love fabric, right? They told me they love fabric. Everybody wants some fabric. And then this piece, I don't know what it was. I just liked it, so I picked it up. I don't know what you really call this. It has um, raised embellish um, piece. And then we have this one. Is he pushing his food bowl around? I think so. So we have that. Here, you can take that. And then we have this. This is a very long runner. It's this wide. And it's got, what would you say, metal? Like metal? metal? in it does it yeah so it's got you know gives it a lot more weight but anyhow this it just sparkles so pretty little design on that and then we got these pieces real quick i hope there's not a hoe under this too since she put tape on it now she had a little piece of tape on that Got this little velour runner, uh, this cutie little piece, it's small. Put a little vase on it or something. Now, I picked up these pieces and she had these all rolled up like this. I should have opened every single one of them, but this is a beautiful piece. So I may put some trim on this and make something of that. And then there's this, uh, nice piece this one's really pretty mm -hmm. roses has a lace uh, trim on it and then this one too was also rolled up it don't have no lace on it but it's a very pretty piece a tapestry kind of material so i'm gonna finish this out as well so i think that's all the linen fabric that we picked up oh no one more piece here because it was at a different place 
That's gorgeous. Very pretty. Like that one. Now the big finale. Is there a big finale? We have more stuff. I got more stuff. Okay. We ain't done yet. We are not done with round top. David pick, picked up all these, what, seven leather uh, books? I picked up seven volumes, not a complete set of the Pageant of America sets. And from Yale University Press, I didn't want anyone else to have them. She has more. These are from 1929. And very handsome. So she's told me to get in contact with her. So I need to have her hunt these down for me. Because I want the whole set if she has them. Then we have this beautiful, I would say pottery. But this is made in Japan. It's got two little divots in here. So I take it this is an ashtray. Therefore, I'm going to pull out them cigarettes and put them in here. So, or just as a fun display. But I think it's a good catch-all. That or, maybe it's an ashtray or is that for the chopsticks? Oh, I don't know. Could it be know. for chopsticks? It's this, an oblong bowl, so. It has a Japan sticker on it, but it sits like this. So, it's lower on this side, higher. It goes up higher on the other side. But I just love the colors. I thought that was very pretty. And Dave's like, yeah. And I'm like, yeah. And he's like, oh, I'm not. He's like, okay. <laughs> and I picked up this drying rack. <laughs> so with all the collectible glass we use, it doesn't go in the dishwasher. And everything's been drip drying on a towel. But now I got a rack. Finally found one. Been looking for it. So we grabbed this. I told him, um, I said, that brings back bad memories because, you know, that's what we had growing up. And that means I had to wash the dishes. Right. Open this. So, then I got this big old box. A big old box of different trims. All this. Oh, that's falling off. Why is that falling off? Falling off the thing. Um, I got a bunch of this, different trims in different colors, green, pink, blue. I didn't even see what's at the very bottom of this. I just kind of bought it sight unseen. I just saw the top of it. So lots of trim. Lots of this trim fabric. Um, you know. Just fun trim. A whole box. A whole box. So that's uh, got maybe coming to a fabric sale. And then I just, I rarely get to find chalkware fish. And here are some. They're not in the best shape. She but didn't care. I didn't care. And not to mention, they were a fabulous price. So, and look, it's these wonderful bright colors. This one had a chip on the tail right there. So I guess the tail should have looked more like this. And it has little nicks, you know, through there. But I love them. These are going on the wall. Kokashis. And here's the other two Kokashis we got. Look at that face. <laughs> this is David. This is me. <laughs> and this one's a bobblehead. Ain't that cute? And these are larger ones. And then, I don't know what these are for. One has a felt on top, but um, they were with a lot of Oriental stuff. And they're risers. I thought they would be great as um, putting on the shelf and making something a little bit higher. So they're just little wooden uh, shelves. Can you take me higher? Yeah. So I picked up all three of those. I, you know, always need that little lift. You know, when I got the dog is taken off of the paper. I always okay. need a, stuff raised a little bit when you got layers going forward like that. Okay, and here, I love this. It's a boy holder. Macrame. 
It's a Merkel May piece. Um, uh, wait, how does this go? Why don't you go to, why don't you go? It goes like this. There we go. So, this is what you hang it from. And this is what it looks like. So, they have these little ceramic uh, beads in the center. It's all orange. Now, there's only one problem with this. What? Right? You can't really tell, right? Did you see it? Did you see it? You're missing a bead here? I'm missing a bead. Yep, right. right here at the very top where these two beads are. Easy fix. No, it's not an easy fix. It is not an easy fix. These are solid ceramic beads. They get crocheted in the process on easy there. Fix. Okay. <laughs> what you do is you... And they ain't got to find one to match. So, anyways, I thought that was fun. It's a little plant, crochet plant. Do we plant still mower. have a spot of wear butterfly? Uh, I might have some. Okay, easy fix. What we were taught to do is you nip it, slide it in there, and retie it, and you're done because it's hidden. Where are you taught that? Well, we did macrame. <laughs> okay, I take back what I said. David's gonna fix this for me. No biting. Did not know David can macrame. Beep, 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 beep. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's time to start the music. It's time to light the lights. It's time to get them started on the Jackie Show tonight. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Tell me, don't you think this is kind of fabulous? I just love this. I just like, what is that? It's plastic. I don't know something stuff. about it. I liked it. Look at that. Now, it, it has little prongs that it sticks right in there, but it she said you could hang it from the ceiling, you know, plug it in straight to the ceiling and you have this automatic light fixture, but you would need some clamps or something on here uh, because it won't stay. But if I put it in a lamp like this, which I do have a lamp that I can put this in mm -hmm. and I'm gonna try it and see what it looks like, mm -hmm. it would fit like this. And I won't even have to worry about the little clamps because it has the little hose that, you know, you can stick it in. It just, if it turns over, it's just gonna come undone. So this is a fun piece. I was like, yeah, I want that. That's that's so me. So, you know, I don't know. What style is this, y'all? I don't know. But I love it. So we got that. Wait, is it, it's time to light the light? No, it's start the music, right? It's time to start the music. It's time to light the lights. Mm. And then I got a six place setting of this. I just love it. Of what? Um, I, we've got a cup and saucer set. It has, uh, ain't that grapes? Well, these grapes? look like cherries. This is a Brock. What did I tell you it was, David? Brock Park. Brock Park? Mal Malame. Mm-hmm. So it had the cup and saucer. Lovely. A bow with a peach, I mean, pear on it. Bow and um, dessert plate, I guess. Sandwich plate. Sandwich plate, salad plate. And then the dinner plate. Look at these colors. They're just fabulous. Fabulous. They're fabulous. Fabulous. <laughs> and there's a six piece place setting. So I think I got that for me got this whole set for me. I just kept staring at it. This was, I looked at it three times and when we were leaving, she had moved it outside onto a little table outside. And I was like, okay, I think I gotta have that. So we got that. Jack's trying to play with me. What else, Tam Tam? And one other thing, if you were watching my videos, this is, the, this is the scene where Christopher Reeve turns into Superman. I did it. I pulled the trigger, y'all. I pulled the trigger. And I got these fabulous grapes. Look at that. Look at David's face right now. George Carrasco is like, how much? I want them. Aren't they lovely? I want, I want two more because I want to hang them in a cluster of three. They're going in Jack-Jack's room. 
So I have blue. I do have a set of orange out there that I had picked up a, a year ago probably, but it needs some repairs. So now I just need another color. So y'all let me know if y'all know where any more are at a reasonable price, because these can be pretty pricey. So I just love that. And I don't know if I should go through all these. Just say what they are. You have a bunch of them. This is just some of them. Hold up that other bag. Hold on, Jack Jack. I Wait, got Jack Jack. a bunch of more, which David did a video not too long ago. More menus. These Look are at this fun. one. The, these are, yeah. There's, there's just all kinds of different ones here that I don't, the lady thought they, a trucker had gotten these. He traveled and they came from a trucker because some of them need to be cleaned too, but got quite a few of some these. Some have trucker residue. <laughs> so. <gasps> what? It's. Jack's coffee shop. Jack has a coffee shop. It's from Phoenix. So, anyways, there's the this stack and the stack that David's ho holding. Maybe I'll do a video on just these. Show that stack. It's quite a bit. So, I just picked up the whole bundle. They were selling them individually, and I just said, I'm going to take a chance now. How much for all of them? So I just, I went ahead and just got them all. Uh, y'all liked, some of y'all liked the few that we did have, and but these are different, a little uh, more plastic on them, hardback and all that stuff. So, and, 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 what do we have left? This. And, ooh, 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 and. One more thing we're gonna show you. Is. It's a pickle jar. Mm. That's some old glass, y'all. Do you have information Ow, on this already? Jackie. There is an owl on it and a butterfly on the lid. I'm trying to hold it all together here. Look at that. Very cool. This one did not have the tongs. It has etching on the glass. Very pretty piece. Do you have something on that? Then we have a remnant. This is all they had of another one. No lid, missing its spoon. You're tilting that a little bit. Hold the glass. It's pretty deep in there, Tim. Well. Very ornate nonetheless. Beautiful design. And on top of that, we may have another piece. And this could be a, um, oh, another another piece very similar to the old that old glass and not necessarily uh uh what is that called pickle caster yeah not necessarily a pickle caster but uh like a, a a jar piece or a jam piece or a marmalade marmalades usually have a spoon okay so yeah but just pretty it's same old old press glass though very nice very nice finds, and I think that was round top. That was this is all round top. What's on your ear, Tim? Oh, oh, I almost forgot. Did anybody has anybody said anything about these yet? <laughs> oh, <What>? Jack Kaz. <laughs> I found these and I just thought they were hilarious, and I thought I would wear them for y'all. Look at that, they're baby earrings. <laughs> so yeah, I almost forgot about these. 
So, well, I already took that one off. So, so y'all let us know. That was everything. That was for three days. This is all for three days. So this video has gone way long. Um, again, let us know what your favorite is. Be sure to come and join us on Tuesday at 2 o'clock Central, 3 o'clock Eastern, and Wednesday night at 7 o'clock uh, Central, 3, 8 o'clock Eastern. Did I say that right? Yeah, or, or I don't know, 3 o'clock somewhere in the Pacific. <laughs> Did I say that wrong? No, you, you corrected yourself. Okay, Wednesday, 7, Central, 8, Eastern. So... Anyways, <laughs> again, if you're not subscribed to us, please do consider um, doing that and be sure to hit all so you'll know when we go no. live, when we do drop um, videos and um, uh, haul videos, everything. It'll let you know anytime we post. So, and that's it. I think that's everything. We really enjoyed our shopping along, shopping in Round Top. You have to wait till the end of September, early October for the fall show. It happens twice a year. So, and regardless. So the next time we go to Round Top will be after we meet up from Memphis. Yeah, yeah. Regardless going and regardless the change that they're doing out there, there are still... Our, we have our favorite vendors. We always go hit. They always have great prices. And, you know, we always find things that we don't find here in Houston. So, so, again, all right, you guys. Let us know what your favorite is. And here come the kids. Bye for now. Bye. Say bye, Chuck Chuck. Four, three, three, two, one. one. If you click that and click that subscribe button click up there, there and then click, 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 give a big, big thumbs, thumbs up. up. Bye. Bye.